All right, everyone, welcome back to Octopath Traveler. So this is, so I just recorded like an hour of gameplay before I realized that I didn't set OBS to actually record the Octopath Traveler window. So it's just a black screen with audio. So yeah, we have to do it all over again, which is fine. Honestly, the last hour that I spent playing, I didn't actually do much. It was just me kind of exploring around, trying to figure out what I wanted to do. Anyways, so I started off by first of all stealing the Zax. I got it first try, which is kind of nice, so I don't have to worry about my reputation. But basically what I'm trying to work up to is to get, basically get some levels on everyone so I can start doing some of these chapter twos. Like, Primo seems to be the lowest level, probably because I started off as her at 21. And even my Primrose is still only 16, so... Probably do some side quests exploring around, and then we'll figure out where to go from there. Mm. It's an ill-fated time to be a fisher, I tell ye. The powder are disappearing from these water gods only know why. How can I feed my kin and my nets come up empty? Talk to you. A proud son of Clearbrook, this fisherman reads the winds and waters like an educated man his letters, and could bring home a king's bounty every day if he saw fit. Out of love for the river, however, he only takes what he needs and leaves which he does not. So I've also decided when it comes to like inquiring, uh, you know, basically talking to people as uh, Alfin or Cyrus, I'm only gonna read out the description if it sounds interesting and if they actually give me like useful information. If it's just like normal backstory stuff, then I won't bother. Otherwise, my, there's no way my voice would hold out. Ooh, I'll, I'll take that. Okay, I, I, I passed the 15% check, but I can't pass this 80. Are you kidding me? Thank you. You can keep that. Yeah, no. Got anything nice on you? I still haven't concocted anything. Should probably consider that. Oh, it's you. I probably don't even need this since I got the other axe. But I'll take it, sure. Hey, pal, can I steal something off of you after I helped... Nah, not worth it. Lots of protective earrings around. A loving mother who cares for her daughter more than anything in the world. She is always there to encourage Mero whenever she loses heart. That sounds imp uh, important. Interesting too, I guess. Oh, it's you, the, the lady. Injurious seat, 80%. No thanks. Let's see, a resident of Clearbrook who enjoys everything about her home from the quiet river and warm sunshine to its kind hearted people. Hey, you, you can keep those. Nice day, isn't it? My name is Merrill. Say, would you mind lending me an ear? Something's happened that I can't tell anyone else about. You see, I found a bottle floating in the river. Odd thing is, there was a letter inside. Want to know what it said? To my Meryl, I loved you dearly, but had no choice but to put you in the care of another. I hope you have found happiness wherever life has taken you. From far away, your mother. But I have parents right here in Clearbrook. I want to ask them about this, but I'm scared of what they'll tell me. Alright. What are the coincidences of that, by the way? Like, just... Just someone decided the best way to get information to somebody is to float down a message in a bottle down a river and hopes that... You know what? Whatever. Oh, it's the father. No father has ever been more proud of his daughter than I am a Meryl. I love her dearly, but she does not know the whole story. Why don't you tell it to me? A man who cares deeply for his daughter, Meryl, his pride and joy, and is always the first to rush to her side in times of need. In truth, Meryl is not his child by birth, a fact which the poor man does not have the heart to share. What about you guys? More plentiful provisions. A devoted connoisseur of Mag's cuisine, who has eaten every dish on the menu. 
No other fate can seem to satisfy. Uh, no other fare can seem to satisfy his cravings, and in recent days, he has refused to eat at home, much to the chagrin of his family. Okay, the townsmith and armor have new. Ooh, Nito. Saucy prawns. Perfect. Oh, the fish guy probably wants that. Yeah, you already told me this. Here you go. Ah, it's you, the traveler. What's this? Merry gift that tastes, uh, but this tastes like heaven. So did you bring me this fine fare to keep up my strength? Because... No, you say? But why then? You don't say the ponder or a gog for these prawns? Then if I use them as bait, I might be able to fill my nets again. Just a waste of fine cookery, I concede. But needs must, as they say, and what my family needs is a plounder. Okay, guy, sure, what you give me? Physical attack of 50. Wow. It's actually quite decent. Probably put it on you. Then we'll go talk to Meryl. Oh, we can also look at the new provisions as well. What's this you say? I wasn't? I'm not? You're saying I wasn't born here? But that can't be true. Can't be true. Why are we telling her this? Oh yeah, I was about to say, shouldn't the parents be telling her this? I fear it is, my love. I also feel like I have superhuman hearing. Forgive us, my dear. We should have told you long ago. It was 19 years ago. A woman came to our doorstep carrying a small babe. With tears in her eyes, she told us the girl's name was Meryl and begged us to look after the child until she could return. We had no children of her own, though we longed for them. She were a gift from the heavens. But, we waited for your mother to come back and claim you. But weeks turned to months, and months to years. In time, we came to think of you as our own daughter. We may not be your flesh and blood, but we love you more than anyone in this world. And I love you too, Mom. Father. But I must find the person who wrote this message. Forgive me. But she might have answers. Answers that I've long been searching for. Do what you must, my love. We shall pray that the flame guides your path. Thank you, Father. Whoever put the bottle in the river must be somewhere along the river. I'll set out as soon as I pack my things. I will find the person who wrote that letter. I'll find the answers I seek. Forgive us, Meryl. Well, I guess we'll be seeing her sometime in the future. I probably left so many side quests in all the other towns, too. So, uh... Yeah. Sure, let's go back to sun sh Sunshade. Full circle, literally. We went we went around the world. Oh, I totally forgot to check the provisions. Whoops. Wait, hold on. One sec. Oh, a cleaver. Feather the hat, elemental light armor, holy, that's a lot of money. <laughs> I 
Maybe I should uh, buy some of these. They're pretty cheap and I don't know. Maybe concoction is actually really strong. Man, I need a new knife. Give you that. I need new knives, new swords, new rods probably too. I need to start buying, I haven't actually bought a whole lot of weapons. And probably more than likely, all the good weapons are probably from stealing people. Or I guess you could buy them too, if you're, you know, stupid. <laughs> this sphere sounds kind of nice. Oh, I should talk to people. Maybe I'll open up some stuff. Like that! Hey, there you go! Though she came to Sunshade to find her mother, she was too late, for the woman had taken ill and passed away. All that remained to give the girl comfort was a dancer's dress, a memento of happier times. I'm not sure why that gave us more weapons, but sure. I think... Oh, this is new. The Falcon Saber, which is um, really expensive. Grand Helm's also new. That's very tempting. That's also a lot of money. I need to get more money. I'm sure there's probably easy ways to make money. Yeah, nothing new. Can't talk to you. Fire Soul Stone, Falcon Dead. Ooh. And a stimulating earring. Wait, what? Not sure where Master Helgen has disappeared off to, but I've got nowhere else to work but here. Well, why are you working there if you're not getting paid? Who's paying you? Yeah, we already did a side quest with these two. <laughs> steal, steal some stuff from a child, why don't we? I can't. All right. Well. Oh, that is. I don't like those odds. I guess I should um save before I start to do stuff. Oh wait, what? This young woman lost her memory after nearly drowning in a river. Unable to recall much of anything beyond her own name, she strives to help others despite her condition. The only thing she remembers is that she spent much time with a crass brute of a man. Is this part of some sort of side quest? That's quite the... <laughs> it's quite the backstory there. <laughs> wow. Wait, hold on. From birth, this elderly woman's vision was quite poor, having near never ventured beyond the borders of sunlands. She has never seen rolling seas nor cloudy skies and likely never will. And she also has a bright stone that prevents blindness. That nice touch. I like it. I'm gonna overwrite these saves since uh won't be able to use them anymore. A flower from an exotic continent far to the south. Well, this is part of a quest, so I'm gonna take that. A preeminent dancer of her time. When she took to the stage, the crowd roared with delight. When she performed, not a word was spoken. When at last she had finished, she slipped away unseen, like a whisper on the wind. Cool. Diva's dress. The last dress a certain dancing star wore on stage. Well, that's mine now, because I need that. Oh. Wayfaring girl, let go of me. I require no escort for the likes of you. Don't be shy, love. I'll take you to places with cushions like the clouds. I'll go where I please, thank you. Now let me go. Uh, what are you gawking at? This ain't a public show. Uh, well, let me take that off your hands. 
Working during the day and splurging that money at night, this man believes in living without regrets and roams the Sunlands trying to do just that. Born with beauty and grace, this charming woman finds it difficult to go anywhere without being badgered by aspiring suitors. Uh... Oh. I was gonna say, I'll take you with me, but I guess that's not the right thing to do. Oh, I can probably beat him up. Yeah, that, that's probably it. Alright. One sec. I got this. Wow, look at- <laughs> There's so many people in here. Also, there's a question mark up here. Ah, oh, there we go. A stinging dagger that poisons. A heavy coin pouch with an 8% chance of stealing. An empty coin pouch. Lots of protective earrings around. Can't inquire with you. Ooh, a discount at the end. Unlike other mercenaries who are accustomed to the sights of sunshade, this greenhorn is not, having never known the intimate company of the fairer sex. Unsurprisingly, this has led him to spend altogether too much coin on the dancing girls, far in excess for, of his meager earnings. Okay, good, good to know, I guess. Oh, that means he's probably really easy to lure. You wanna come with me? Never mind you. Oh, you know, that might actually be all right. Healing great medium. Critical earring. Ooh, wow. Fetches an exorbitant price if sold. Yeah, no thanks. <laughs> that, that's a coin toss I'm not willing to take. Man, that's not what I wanted to do. Who are you? Oh, you're the tavern. All right. Would you look at that? That useless saw is our hired arm. He's supposed to keep the peace when our customers get a bit rowdy. But all he does is drink, not work. His coin disappears as quickly as the sands in an hourglass. Maybe if someone actually bested him in a fight for once, he'd learn to take his position with a bit more gravity. Me? Are you mad? Have you seen the size of him? I couldn't beat someone like that in a fight. Or more people to beat up, I guess. Adios. Let's see, something to steal? Alright, well, let's see. Uh, I'll bring Cyrus, or not Cyrus, Alberic. I was, I was gonna say I'll replace Cyrus, but then I decided now I'll, I'll replace uh, Tarion since I do actually need swords. That's something I need to keep in mind actually is that I should start unequipping stuff when I'm not using those characters. Although now that I think about it, I should I should keep um I should keep Tarion in the party for at the moment. Alright, well, we're going to be fighting one-on-one, -on -one, so I'm going to put some my best stuff on you. Speed. Max HP, maybe. I'm actually going to go maybe buy a spear. I think there's an okay spear in this shop. It's kind of expensive. 
No, I, I wanted to steal this. Ooh! Won the coin toss. Yeah, Sunland Spear. Alright, I'm gonna buy this. I think Tressa uses spears as well, so... Alright, I'm gonna go save real quick. There's a couple people I wanna... wanna fight. Alright, so I wanna fight this guy up here. I think, anyway. Ooh, wow. Level 4. A battle fair and square to arms. You want to challenge me? It'll be the last thing you do. So, Oh. Well. Okay. Oh, I should I should grab the uh the defense thing for Oberic. I'll probably be really helpful for duels. Wow. This guy's got next level tactics. Alright, seriously, how many of these things do you have? And stop doing them when I get two turns in a row. Are you kidding me? What? Oh my goodness. You know, I actually, I do have, alright, I was about to say, I do have a, uh, an accessory that prevents sleep. I didn't think I'd have to put it on, but maybe I should. Damn it all, I'll not be forgetting this. You have my thanks. That man would not take no for an answer. I only came here because I heard that this is where people come to have fun in this town. I swear, doesn't the local tribe do anything to maintain order? How is a girl supposed to enjoy the city if she can't even walk down the street in peace? Ruffians like that man should not be allowed to wander free. I mean, that's a little extreme. I mean, yeah, he was kind of, you know, trying to pick you up, but he wasn't technically doing a crime. Oh, but forgive me, I seem to have gotten carried away. You wish to know who I am? Ah, well, that's rather. I am... Oh, yes, I am on a journey, I suppose. My name is... Rhea. You may call me Rhea. Anyhow, I will not forget your kindness in helping a stranger like myself. Thank you again. If nothing else, at least my journey has shown me that there's still some good people left in the world. I like how she's telling this to Primrose when it was Old Bear who fought. And now I must say farewell. I hope that your own travels bring you joy. Oh, we'll be seeing each other again real soon. Probably. I don't know. Is that you again? Are you just... whatever. The other, other person I want to beat up is this lady because she's blocking this door. So, challenging me to a fight here and now. I like your spirit. Well, at least she's a good sport about it. Alberic is all about gender equality. Oh man, this is okay. Well, you know. Oof. I'm really sorry about that. That 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 was me. <laughs> A fine fight. 
Oh, hey, look. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh no, I was so mean. Oh man. Oh, I already have one of those too. Oh. That was the last gift she had from her dead mother. And I just beat the crap out of her and literally stole it. Wow. Um I'm really sorry, but I, I can't put it back. I can't put it back. Yeah, that is Wow. Um I feel really bad now. Let's let's go beat up some more people to make me feel better. Oh, uh, before that, let's see. Oh, phew, I can. I have exactly a thousand JP. Oh, uh, let's do this, I guess. Use support skill. Ah. Oh. Attacks all foe with an axe, dealing damage inversely proportional to current HP. Unleash an axe attack on a single foe. No, I'll just take amputation, because that sounds mean. Oh man, I can't learn anything any. I really want that. That sounds really good for duels. I'll recover a certain amount of SP each. Ooh! Neato! I thought that they would put that effect on like a trinket or something, but I'll take that. Uh, with each successful standard attack, gain SP equal to 1% of the damage you deal. That doesn't sound that good. Can yeah, maybe the steal first? Nah, no. alright, well. This is probably a bad idea. A scrap with me? I may be fight, but I know how to drunk. Wait, I mean. This is not going to go well. Ooh, ow, that hurts. Oh, well. Hey, that helps. Oh, oh, oh okay, that is... Kind of scary. Ah. Uh. Wow. This guy hurts. I liked it better when you couldn't attack me. What? I'm supposed to act earlier on my next turn. What are you doing? Well, good thing he was too drunk to move. You no, know, for a drunk, he sure has a lot of his speed. He's gonna kill me. <sighs> Good job, Alberic. <clears throat> yeah, you idiot. Great, now we have to go sleep at the end because you suck so much. Aren't you supposed to be like some sort of like legendary knight? You got your ass beat by some drunk guy. You suck. Should have brought Hana in her Pokemon instead. So, oh crap, I forgot <laughs> to change to Spears. I'm having to spend a lot of time healing. Oh, 
That's the wrong move. Oh crap, I did the AoE move instead. Wow. Good job. Man, I'm just popping these grapes like no tomorrow. Okay, I think it's better to use the spear attack since he's weak to that. Alberic, <sighs> you suck so much. <clears throat> to be fair, that was my fault. I should have healed there because I saw that he was taking two turns in a row. And Alberic, I'm wasting so many nights at the end because of you. Do I have better equipment? What the hell are you wearing right- what is this? What kind of crap are you wearing right- what is this? Why do you have on some really shitty armor? <laughs> That's why. This is- what? Alright, put on that. Oh, there's an optimize button, I guess. Well, there you go, fine. Maybe now you won't die as quick. Well, you still do a lot of damage, but it is noticeably weaker. It's about the same amount of damage. Oh, I should have healed. I should have healed. I should have healed. Oh, wow. I lucked out. Man, I like how this is supposed to make me move earlier in the next turn, and it's like, nah, man, you, you still, you're still too slow. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna heal. I'm gonna play it a bit safe this time because I don't want to fail again. How much health do you freaking have? How are you still alive? It's like the third time I did that on you. You're really annoying the crap out of me right now, you know that? How are you still alive? What is this? How many grapes I'm wasting on this? Oh, 
Freaking finally. When did my arm get so slow? Have I really been that long out of practice? Well, I'm not having no more of that. It's off to the training yard for me. Yeah, you totally need it. That was a good fight, though. First proper fight I've had in a long while. I think you didn't think you'd be able to handle yourself that well in a fight, friend. This one here is a right famous swordsman here in the desert. That's why I hired him to guard my shop. Everyone knows him by reputation. No one would ever dare start a fight with him that they couldn't finish. And in his boredom, he turned to the bottle. But look at you now, you're looking like your old self again. I think that woman gave him just what he needed. Thank you, stranger. I mean, to be fair, even when he was drunk, he was still kicking my ass. So I think he would have been just fine if you just left him. But, you know. Alright, well that was fun getting my butt kicked. Maybe I should just go around the starting towns doing all these side quests to get money and stuff. Look at all these side quests that I just left here last time. No, oh, I want to talk. A young man who joined the watch together with his childhood friend. Rather more level-headed than his said friend, his calm demeanor and sound judgment have caught the eye of the headman, who believes the watchman may be a suitable successor to his own post. Adios. Hey, discounts. I already beat the crap out of you, didn't I? An elderly man to whom the people of Cobblestone looked for guidance. After losing his wife in the fires of war, he laid down his arms once and for all. Without hesitation, he welcomes those bearing similar scars to his own and refrains from asking after the ghosts that may haunt them. What a nice old man that I beat up the other day. Oh, I forgot I can steal stuff. A friend came back from a long sea journey and brought back a bag of curious seeds. It would be a shame not to plant them, so I'm thinking of clearing land and making a new field. But you need manure to prepare forest soil. Would you mind fetching me some? Oh, okay. Accuracy. Ooh, a silver spear. Coin toss. I'll save first. Oh yeah, didn't, didn't I want to fight you earlier? Captain of the Watch. <sighs> I mean, this is probably a bad idea, but sure. Why, it'd be an honor to spar with you again. Hey, this is considerably easier than the last fight. Alright, let's actually try buffing this time. Ah, well. Alright, that's fine. Alright, what were you guarding? Ooh. Occasionally decreases target's uh, defense. Wow, it's a nice sword. Thanks, Captain. I wanted 
to steal. Thank you. Cow droppings. The perfect poop for fertilizer. Thanks. Those are both very, very nice. Wow. Um, yeah. Broadsword. I don't need that. I have, I got the captain's sword. I'm fine. Wow, you have a lot of dust. Alright, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna save. Ah, you know what? Hold on. Before we try to steal, why don't we try and actually buy it the honest way, alright? Let's see. Five thousand for this spear, holy crap. Wow, that's actually that's a fair price. Considering it's like an eight percent chance to steal. I will gladly purchase this off of you. I'll also buy that because that sounds. Yeah, that, you know, that's probably not. You know, nah. I'm good. I don't need to buy that. Attractive? No. My wares, I mean. Oh, 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 oh. Okay. You're so funny. Alright, Tarion. This is. I, sh I should not be doing this right now, but you know what? This is this is so dumb. Why am I doing this to myself? Yeah. You know, what, I'll just I'll come back to that. We don't we don't need it right now. Just need to remember there's there's a really good speed trinket or accessory here. Yeah, I'll take that marble though. That's a nice marble. Could use more shields. Why not? Is there an item hidden somewhere? Oh, in your house. Well, this is unfortunate that I have to beat you up twice. That's not bad. It's almost as good as the Sunland Spear I just got. Speaking of spear, don't you have a spear too? Okay, it's not as good. Well, I have two decent spears, so I don't need to get that off of you. A pummel. Alright, sure. I'm a historian seeking traces of the legendary King Beowulf the Great. I'm sure you've heard tell of him. Why, it was none other than he who founded the Kingdom of Hornburg. Some colleagues who shall remain nameless for their sake mock my work. King Beowulf is just a myth they laugh. But I say, no, I know that they are wrong. That's why I'm here, you see, to discover the Great King's Monument and prove that he did once walk this worth. 
Perhaps you could help me. If you happen to come across some ancient plinth or carved granite or some other stony erection, pray tell me at once. Um, okay. I guess I'll have to keep an eye out for that. Ah, <sighs> oh, my sweet, where art thou, uh, where art thou, Lori? I came to this village of searching for my Laurier. Lori? Laurier. I don't know. And I'm told she's already left. Um, you want to come with me? Exploit weakness. Sure, I guess. <laughs> Lord, is that you? Oh, well, you better not tell your girlfriend about that. <laughs> that's just, that's not going to go well. Oh. Alright, I got you this cow droppings. I'm sure you're gonna be real happy about that. Well, summer's day, that's cow manure you have there. And sweet smelling stuff it is too. Mixed with wheat husks, it makes a fine fertilizer fit for any crop. It's not so fragrant when it's on the ground, sadly. But it makes the soil soft and uh, f uh, f fry friable. <laughs> Freeable. Fry fry yeah. I know that word. You need soil like that to soak up the rain to let the roots grow deep. Yeah, thanks. I, I know how fertilizer works. See, in land fresh reclaimed by the forest, the soil is hard like clay and nothing you plant will take. Yeah, I, I, I know. Thank you for the dung, my friend. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, here's your shit. Give me some plums. Alright, well, that's fine. Ripple Tide. Was there any side quests I left here? I know I did some. Well, it's all worth it to go back and steal and talk to people. Poison Arrow. That sounds neat. I hope Tressa doesn't mind me stealing from her parents. Source SP after every act. Yo! I want that scarf. Give me that scarf. Well, I, I, I can't steal the scarf, but I can purchase the scarf. You're making your own daughter buy the scarf off of you? What is this? Restores HP, SP, and BP to a single... Oh, I thought that was a... <laughs> For a second, I thought that was a trinket. I was like, what? Restores HP after every action. I mean, that sounds helpful too, but not nearly as cool as the SP. I want the SP more than anything. Looks like I have to actually buy those, though. That's like half my money. That's a, that's a nice bow you got there. That's a... That's a nice bow you got there. Alright, I'm gonna change out... You for... Uh, actually, I want Alfin. Alfin doesn't piss off people when he talks to them. A merchant hailing from the highlands who carries only the best and most distinguished liquors. The tavern in Sunshade is one of his most loyal clients. He knows everything about the taste of his merchandise as he does as he doesn't drink any himself. Oh, he knows everything but the taste of his own merchandise. An unreliable man living in Rippletide. His frail exterior bellies a resolute heart which cannot be easily shaken. Oh, this quest, I remember this. Why can't he seem to understand? The same stubborn fool has proposed to me ten times over, you see. Every time I turn him down and every time he runs home crying all the way. What woman in a right man would want to marry such a spineless and fragile man? Not me, that's for sure. 
Okay. Known for her beauty, this woman is the object of affection for many. Men come to Ripple Tide from far and wide, seeking her hand, though her scathing words chase them all away. How much for the shield? That's eh. Maybe. I might actually buy that. It's not bad. Hey! Hey, I, I should have saved first. Oh, can I beat you up yet? Oh, wait. I put, uh, I, I tossed Alberic away. Alright, so first things first. We're gonna save. I kind of want to beat you up. I already looked at everyone's inventories the first time I was here, so. Alright, tavern. Tavern in 108? Holy crap! Well, I guess that's fine. Right, I'm gonna save one more time so I don't have to do that again. I'm gonna beat that guy up. Oh, I can't. Oh, well, that's, um, embarrassing. I could beat this guy up, maybe. Oh, holy crap. You know, I thought he were, like, kind of scrawny, but... Okay, that... <laughs> I'm not sure that would get the result I want. Maybe I should beat, beat her up. Same stuff for fools proposed to me. Well, let's fight. So. Matilda likes men that are strong. Okay, I'll do it. Wait, what if I just throw the fight? Alright, you know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna throw the fight on purpose. I wonder if the game will let me do this. Hold on. Okay, well, crap. I didn't even have to try that hard to throw that fight. He's just really strong. Tony, I never knew you were so strong. I even surprised myself, Matilda. But when I thought of you, and knew that I was battling for our future, I was filled with strength such as I've never felt. Alright, don't flatter yourself, dude. Some random guy just challenged you to a duel. I don't know why you're saying you were battling for your future with this woman. Matilda, I would do anything for you. Why, I would lay down my very life for your happiness. And so I ask once more, will you give me your hand in marriage? Oh, Tony, I never realized your love was so strong and true. Yes, a thousand times yes. And yeah, don't mind me, I'm just on the floor bleeding. Alright, well, I'm glad you guys are happy. I shall protect my true love, Matilda, now and forever. As long as she is by my side, I feel unstoppable. I feel so safe knowing, he, knowing Tony loves me so. I'm sorry I ever doubted his convictions. Wow, you two are just great. You are fantastic. I think I wanted to steal from you. No, I didn't. Who did I want to steal from? No, I can't steal from you. 
I wanted to steal from somebody. I don't remember who. Yeah, it was you. Watch for this bow. Ah, it's a little, it's a little high there. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna save. <sighs> All right, you know what? No, I'm not. I'm not gonna try and steal that bow right now. Here's what. Here's what I'm gonna do. So you guys don't know this, but I keep a bunch of like index cards, right? Just by my desk. They are just perfect for keeping notes. You know, for for recordings, for you know games. So, look, there's a, there's a there's a nice bow and ripple tide that I want to steal. And I don't re I don't remember what was in the last town. Oh yeah, it was a, there was a speed accessory in uh, cobblestone. So I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna I'm not gonna do this while I'm recording. I'm gonna steal these in between recording. So. Yeah, I don't have to worry about editing it out later, so that's what I'm going to do. But what I am going to do... Wait, hold on. That's wrong. That's the wrong door. What I am going to do... I am going to buy this scarf off of my own mother because she can't just give me this scarf. It's half my, half my gold. Or half my leaves. That gleam in your eye reminds me so much of your father. Yeah. Always looking to buy stuff off of my own mom. Alright. I don't remember. I don't remember if I did stuff in Atlas M. I'm basically just going around all the towns talking and stealing stuff. Alright, I need... um. Oh, wow. I need to uh, get Alfin back so I can talk to people. House Landar Records contains notes about the location of the Highborn's family's secret treasure trove. Well, that sounds important. You know, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say that beyond um, quest items and maybe the items in the first, like in Boulder Fall, 80% is probably the max uh, you can get for stealing stuff. No, I just just talk to him normally. <laughs> I am a teacher at the Royal Academy. You may call me the Ratio or Terratio, but I'm afraid that I'm being hounded by nasty, vicious money lenders. I repaid all my parents' debt, but the interest. They always claim that I haven't paid all of the interest. Wait, did I talk to you already? Hold on. Journal. Side stories. Where are we? Highlands, probably? Oh no. Clifflands, Woodlands, Frostlands. Flatlands, probably? Yeah, here we go. I'm being hounded by nasty, vicious moneylenders. Yeah, I already talked to you. Alright, well. Let's see if I can't figure out your issue here. That's pretty low level gear. I don't know why I yawn so much in my recordings. Maybe it's because I, I talk so much. <laughs> oh, wow. This is Oak Staff. It's actually quite nice. I should get one of these. It's, it's also kind of expensive, and I just spent like half my money. I'm going to spend another half of my current money again.
There's a side quest over here. Nobody has anything interesting to steal. Eh. I forgot to grab Alfin so I could talk to people. This tome, the ancient capitals, contains a record of the ancient city of gold. Look, do you see? An entire city where everything is made of gold. I wish there were more details on it. It's only the briefest mention. Eh. Didn't I get information about some sort of treasure trove? I don't know. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna go grab Alfin. Instead of Alberic. I don't think I need to be fighting anybody here. I need a level alpha so I can just talk to people. It's like, look, I can't even talk to this person. Level 10. Level 10. Guide with ease. After the great pestilence in the Riverlands, this apothecary decided to dedicate himself to disease prevention and swift treatment. He now works together with the Royal Academy and Atlas Dam to create both medicine and new forms of treatment. Oh, so with Ophelia, I can guide people more easily, I guess. And apparently I fixed my reputation. Childhood friend with a reckless boy by her side. Being the older by two years, she was entrusted with watching over him. Despite his endless curiosity oftentimes putting them both in danger, she takes her role seriously and is prepared to face whatever challenges come her way. Adios. Smarter bartering. Ooh. Brimming with curiosity, this young boy will go to whatever lengths necessary to sate and interest, even if it puts him in danger. Though his reckless tendencies worry those around him, the oftentimes rare and valuable items he brings back from his adventures have earned him the esteem of his friends. Adios. You have a better chance of getting a discount when you purchase items. So, oh, well, that's not. I thought it was going to decrease the items, not give me a better chance at a discount. But, I mean, that's fine, I guess. I don't even think there's anything I want to buy. Oh man, Alpha, you need to get some levels. Like, I know you're the last person I picked up, but... You better repay me with what I'm due. Your debts are only going to keep growing at this rate. Your parents must be weeping in the afterlife to see you like this, Professor. You spineless weakling, good for nothing but cracking open books. Wow, alright. Maybe this problem is solved a lot more easily than I assumed. Alright, Alberic. We've been beating up a lot of people today. Why does Alberic look so pissed? Why does Olberic look like that? Is he supposed to look like that? I don't remember Olberic looking like that. <laughs> he looks like he's really mad about something. I, I'm not sure what's going on there. Maybe because he lost the last duel? Well, don't worry. Uh, wait, that's the wrong person. <laughs> well, don't worry. So Oh, that's why, because he's about to freaking die. Okay. <laughs> well, well, crap. <laughs> oh, 
その手覚悟はいいかその手覚悟はいい覚悟はいいあまた一つ強くなる。感謝する Look, he even leveled up. Now I don't have to sleep at the end. What do you think you're doing? You planning on sticking up for this useless milk sop? I know that you've been illicitly inflating the debt that is owed you. Yet I've continued to pay you all that you demanded, not wanting to give you any chance to dirty my father's good name. But I have paid you more than enough. Or should we take it to some greater authority and see whose side of justice comes out upon? Huh, do as you please. Thank you very much. Your courage inspired me to find my own. It's time that I propel myself to pursue my own dreams. I've been thinking for some time that I would like to set out on a journey. There are so many poor children in this world who cannot get the education they deserve. I want to change that. And I will begin right here in the flatlands. I will embark on a journey to teach the poor children of these lands. Well, that's nice of you. Man, can you guys give me like better stuff? Like, you guys keep giving me all these nuts and fruits. I like that one fisher who gave me a belt. That increased my stats. It was really nice of him. Stop off all of these people. Now, why did you have to go and do that? Because you're a dick? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> oh, hey, it's this lady. Yeah, that's fine. Some Mitchell's possessions. Yeah, I, I, I vaguely recall not being able to talk to anybody in here, so we'll just leave. I don't remember if I went back up here, though. Large feather. Ooh, yeah, three for three. <laughs> I wonder how many of those things I just have sitting in my pocket. I should probably sell them because I do need the gold. Ooh, yeah, four for four. Goki Genyo. I collect great arts, uh, great, yeah, great arts of work. I collect great works of art, and this particular artist has been a favorite of mine lately. The only trouble is, I have is that this artist is quite particular and refuses to paint anything but landscapes. Still, I wish I could find more of his work. If only I could track down more examples. Alright then. A collection, you know, a fruit bowl would suffice. You don't need three different chests to keep one piece of fruit in each of them. Why do you have all of these weapons? You know, these are pretty cheap, so I'm just gonna buy them. Look, I even got a nice little discount. I should... I'm running out of money, man. I need to figure out a way to make money. I 
I'm actually really surprised they just let me through to the throne room area. I have no one else to talk to. Alright. Well, I don't think I can fix this guy's issue right now. I need to find the artist, I guess. Goki Ganyu. He wants a painting, I guess. Well, that's fine. Alright, well. Next town it is. Flames Grace. Oh, I remember you. Mm. Mm. Still can't believe my father fled from battle, so I need to find information about that. Sword. Old coin. Oh man, come on. It's it's just a coin. Yeah, thanks. Why am I buying these? This, did I go down here last time? Yeah, I went down there. All right. Oh, can I beat you up? I don't remember if I did this last time. Really sorry about this, by the way. Man, didn't even last more than two attacks. Oh, hi. How's it, how's it going? Silver sword, that's pretty neat. Oh, you have some decent stuff on you, friend. You also have the unfortunate misfortune of being right next to the save point. So you know what's already going to happen. Well, yeah, all right. That's that's fair. Hey, I only failed once. That's I'll take it. So mine now. Quest here. Oh, hi, person in jail. Please, please listen. I swear that I'm innocent. I've not killed anyone. I've never done it. I just came across the body, that's all. There was a person there, covered in blood. What would anyone do? Of course I bent down to see if they were alright. I was only trying to help. But the investigation of that man's death was no more than a pretense. That mockery of justice is why I'm now in this cell. Well, um... That's not much to go off on. I guess I have to start talking to people. Oh. I really need to get my... I need to get outfit level. I need to get everybody leveled, honestly.
ですね。Oh, chest. Hey, another grape. I'm yay. Man, everyone just has freaking fruit all the time. Hey, how are you doing, friend? Mm -hmm. All right, well, not so great. Right, I don't think there's anything I can really do here. Uh, I already pretty much handled everything I could over there. Boulder fall. Oh, actually, you know what? No, that's not true. Do I still have that lady with me? She'd be following Ophelia if I did. I need to figure out where this lady goes. Yeah, I must still have her with me. Alright, hold on. Let me check. Change party. Put Ophelia back. Okay, yeah. I still have the lady. She needs to go to Boulder Fall. And I, I have... I've not found the person she wants to find. Mm. Whatever should I do? Oh, yeah, I totally forgot about your egg. I know where it is, though, I think. Oh, I can't fight. Oh, 25. He's very weak, though. Wait. <sighs> Wait what? <sighs> My tiger is dead and gone. We were together for years, and he was like a friend to me. He gads how I miss that striped scamp. All right, well, that's interesting. Yeah. Yeah, we know. Yeah. Ooh. Oh. Oh, holy crap! My love! Sweetness, you are safe! But why risk the journey, love? Just a few more weeks and my work would have been done here. Forgive me, I had a gift for you. I just couldn't wait. A pair of shoes? Privates, they're as light as feathers, but strong and stoutly made. I ordered them special from the cobbler. I thought they'd help you at work. I knew you would like them, and I just couldn't wait to give them to you. You bring joy to my heart, my love, and to see you safe and sound is the greatest joy of all. Thank you for the gift, they're just what I needed. Why are you thanking me? <laughs> I'll take the money though, because I really do need it. Alright, your egg, I know where it is. I think I need to redo my party though. Hold on. Alright, uh. I want Alfin. And, uh. Yeah, I guess this is fine. Yeah, that's fine. Alright. Alright, equip all. Alright. Got this nice new staff. Don't take a circlet. There is an optimize button, I guess, I could start using. Dancer Guard gives uh, SP. This gives speed. Speed and SP is probably pretty decent to have on a healer. Or just more HP. Take the HP. 
take the necklace. A dragon scarf. I'll take the dragon scarf as well, I suppose. Okay, I already have a decent axe. have the mighty belt I guess put some speed and I don't know SP on you I guess alright I should head to the end it's gonna cost a lot I bet where's the end there it is okay that's not so bad Drop a save real quick. Man, we've been recording for a while, even though I haven't actually done a whole lot. Well, I've been going around and exploring the towns more that I have more path action, so I guess that constitutes as productive. I'm getting some more gear. I'll probably do some, uh, like, level grinding when I'm done recording here. This self-styled wandering seller of fish pays no heed to how his actions affect others and will gladly resort to questionable methods to achieve his ends. When he fails to procure sufficient plunder or suffers some other embarrassment, he is quick to give up and seek profit elsewhere. Well, what a swell guy. Yeah, there's the egg. Oh, I forgot I have that too. Oh, that is so good. Magic is just so powerful. So being able to have SP regen on your magic users. So good. I need to farm more dragon scarves. I remember when I played Persona 5, that was basically like the best best accessories you could have. The ones that uh gave you um regen on your Man, I don't even remember what it was called in that game. Was it SP in that game? I don't remember. Alright, let's try this. Hold on. Medicinal value, medicinal hat. Here we go. Injure seed with um Nox root. Here you go. Doyle. Hey, look, I poison them. Oh wait, that wasn't what I wanted to do. So it looks like the SP regen is uh, just a flat 6 SP. It's not based on max SP since Primrose and Ophelia have vastly different max SP but still only get the same amount, so that's kind of unfortunate.
ごめんね素人さんとは踊らないの Hey, level up. I'm not, I'm not even sure where I'm going. Where does this lead? <laughs> where am I? I like how I went here, the whole intent was to just get that egg. Now I'm just kind of going on an adventure. That's fine. Apparently, there's a side quest in here. As a nice axe. Wow. Alright, this goes to Sunshade. Oh. Oh. Yeah, technically, I haven't gone to this path. This connects all the way to. So, th this really does go full circle. That's fine. There's a cave up here, too. It's level 20. I probably shouldn't mess with it. I'm gonna go inside just to, um, get it on my map so I can come back here later. When I wanna level grind, maybe. Uh, you know, we can just teleport back to Boulder Fall, right? Yeah, let's just do that. All right, lady, I found your egg. My egg, oh, thank the gods, there's not a crack on it. Isn't it wonderful? I had a dream, you see. It was ever so strange. Our dragon appeared before me and then it started to speak. It was funny, even though the dragon was enormous, I wasn't scared at all. It spoke like a highborn lady, ever so posh, and I could tell it was wise too. The dragon said it would give me an egg, and that I had to take care of it. Well, it was just a dream, of course, but it seemed so real. So I went to the place the dragon told me about, and upon my honor, there was a giant egg. Well, after being sent there, of course I had to take good care of it. The dragon told me something else, too. I heard that in the old days, all dragons were wise, and they'd often talk to folk like us. But now there are hardly any wise dragons left in the world. So I have to raise the baby dragon when it hatches and teach it to talk like people. There's a man in Corycrest who knows all there is to know about eggs. They say he's hatched everything from spiders to griffins. I... I hate him already. That's where I'm headed. If anyone can help me hatch this egg, it'll be him. Anyway, must be going. Thank you for finding my egg. Oh, my name's Kaya, by the way. If you ever need anything, you just let me know. But, bye. All right, well, I'll see you later, I guess. Jeez. All right, everyone, welcome back. So I've been grinding a little bit. I uh, got some money, got a little bit of levels, not a whole lot of EXP, but uh, I, I was, I'm just kind of exploring around, find a, found a, like a place just out of sight of Borderfall that was uh, around level 17, which was kind of where I was grinding at the moment. And then I realized, that I actually found this, which is in the, uh, we're in the South Quarry Crest Pass. I do believe this is, uh, one of the shrines you can find to unlock secondary jobs. So, yeah, this looks like this is probably the thief. Voice echoes in your head. Hail, Traveler. I am Aber, Prince of Thieves. Unto thee who dost boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Uh, and yep, you unlock the thief as a secondary job. And then, uh, yeah, alright, that's, that's, alright, let's see. 
open up new strategies in battle with secondary jobs. A secondary job changes more than just the weapons and skills available to you. You can switch your secondary job freely, but only one character can use a given secondary job at a time. So, it looks like we... Oh, there we go. And yeah, we only have the thief now, so... There should be the s other seven. Uh, and since this was... Kind of close to Boulderfall, I imagine the other jobs are kind of around. So that's kind of like my new goal now, is that... To, to just go around finding all the shrines to get these. Because, uh, yeah, that sounds awesome. So, I'm not actually sure who I'm going to put the thief on right now. But, yeah, that's cool. So, now I want to go find the rest of them. So, uh, I really want to find the sorcerer. So, Cobblestone, Ripple Tide, Atlas Dam. Alright, let's go to Atlas Dam. Presumably, I should be able to just... You know, it should be around here, considering, or not the sorcerer, the, uh, the scholar. I don't know, it's just weird that a scholar, it has all the magic. I'm used to scholars being more defensive classes than offensive. But, uh, I am not equipped to deal with these. Actually, no, I have bows. That's... That's not true. I have bows. And I think Alfin has ice. Oh, well, that works too. I think these things are weak axes. Yeah, there we go. No, now that I think about it, I should probably be bringing um, Cyrus with me. If we're going to be exploring areas, I probably want to be able to uh, reduce encounters. As much as possible, that way we don't get halted. Also figured out that there's a freaking run button. <laughs> Just like... I don't think the game ever tells you that there's a run button, but there's a run button. Oh, I think I found a dungeon. A little force here. Oh dang. Uh, yeah, you take it. Also went back and uh, nabbed like some of those things I wanted earlier, like the uh, the speed accessories and and stuff like that. So that's helping out a lot. I don't know why I did that. That was a weird move. It doesn't really matter. These things are quite under level to what we're we are right now. Alright, what is this? The Whistlewood? It's a level 15, uh... Well, now we know this is here. I should come back here to, uh, to grind a bit, too. I know there's a couple of uh, level 15, like, dungeon areas. They're not actual dungeons, I guess they're just, like, zones that I can use to sort of explore, find uh, maybe some equipment, and get the levels there as well while we're just kind of clearing it out. Alright, we're in the Western Noble Court Flats, I believe. This, this, this area is level 17 as well. And... There's two icons. I don't remember which one it is which, but I'm pretty sure one of these is, in fact, the, uh, uh, a job shrine, I guess. Hey, look! Nido. Apparently I've fought in this sheep before. 
負けません聖火の光輝きたまえかかってきなおりゃっ負けませんはい、ピンロス、come on、let's finish this。I'm actually really excited to, to be able to unlock secondary jobs. If I understand correctly, when you unlock it, you get to um, you get access to all of the weapons they can use. So that'll really help for being able to just expose weakness, and also just generally more um. Versatility with all the characters as well. Why does this sheep have so much HP? Let's see, can this... Can this cure sleep? It can, alright, that's good. Finally. Wow, that barely gave any XP too. That was stupid. Who the hell are you? I can't figure that out. That damn old coot chasing me off like that. And what do you want, huh? Get away from me. Alright, well, fine. Oh, there's a chest. And a cave. Shrine of the Sage. Um. Maybe. Oh, please be sorcerer. Or scholar. I keep calling it sorcerer. Because I think usually when it comes to, to it, like, um, like sorcerers, mages. I don't think scholar when I think of offensive magic. I guess I'm just too much into that Final Fantasy XIV mindset. I am Elephon, the Scholar King. Unto thee who dost boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Yeah, there we go. That's what I needed. All right, so I actually already decided who's gonna get this, and that's that's gonna be Primrose for sure. Oh, I can start unlocking stuff. Oh, that already! Wow. All right, hold on. Skills. Oh yeah, that's that's great. So I don't have Panther Dance right now, and whatever the uh, the last one is. But I can start learning um, all of this stuff. Yeah, that's that's gonna be helpful. I I, I, I wonder if I get um, Cyrus's like passive just um, analyze that just happens at the beginning of every fight. Probably not though. All right, so I'm just gonna start off with getting some more versatility there and now now I can cast a lot of different magics as Primrose and since she's always going to be in my party that's uh, really helpful oh I got evasive maneuvers on this uh, I'll grab blizzard I think because I think I already have firestorm on on Cyrus yeah that's that's cool that's cool all right Oh, and I can I can wear uh, or, or uh, equip staves now, so that'll be helpful as well. I wonder if your your weapons stack or probably not. I imagine when you cast magic, I imagine it just takes whatever your your highest attack is. So uh, in, in this case, the highest I could get is 194 with this knife, but I'm not actually sure. The game doesn't really explain that too well. Yeah, that's awesome. 
Now I have a lot more magic I can use as as Primrose, which is just great. Although I, my sprite didn't really change. I thought it changed. Yeah, it, it changed there. Oh well. I am curious as to what what that other icon is because it looks similar to the shrines, but I don't know. I guess we'll go check it out since we're here already. Oh yeah, it changes in battle. All right, well, that's that's fine, I guess. Nope. <laughs> that does no that does no damage. Alright. Sure. Oh man, that is so good. That is fantastic. I just I get to make Primo so much more versatile now. She has like alright, so she has she can use dagger staves. And then she also, she pretty much has access to most of the magic. She doesn't have wind or light. The magic is really strong in this game, so... Oh man, that is, that is so good. <laughs> she also has uh, SP regen as well. I wasn't expecting you to live through that. You have to be like almost dead, right? Yeah, pretty much. Ah, yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, man, that's so nice. All right, so just just six more to go. I, w I, I want to know what the hell this symbol is. What is this? The Hollow Throne. Oh. So I've noticed, even though you can come across like little dungeons like this, they don't actually show up on your map unless you go inside. So that's why I've just kind of been going inside everything. All right. Uh, sure. Let's go find the cleric, I guess. Alright, so I was looking for the cleric one, and I ended up somehow passing through all the snow fields into the forest area, but I think I found the hunter one, but it's in a level 21 era right now. Yep, huntress right there. Oh, that, that is, uh, that's a, that's a tree with arms. It's a creeping tree end. Yeah, that's, those are what those are called. I'm gonna die. Ooh, oh that hurts. Well, it's a good thing that I. Ooh, uh, it's a good thing that I have um two healers with me right now. Look, this has to be weak to to access, right? Yeah, it's a tree end. That makes so much sense. That it's actually kind of cute. Alright, let's do some healing. Oh, 
Not weak to bows. I, whoop, wrong one. Alright, well. Hopefully let's end this. Or let's not. That's fine too. Man, these things have a lot of HP. <laughs> wow. Oh! Ow! Oh, man, I don't have... I don't have, um, the revive thing. I guess that's fine. You have lots of all of survives, uh, of, of lives left. Nope. Man, this is becoming quite the ordeal. <laughs> Alright, it's almost dead. Finally. Yeah, that was, uh... Those are some beefy enemies. But Shrine of the Huntress... Oh, there's even a chest in here. Wow. Wow, with an all of life large in it. I am Drefendi, Drefendi, the Huntress. Unto thee, who dost boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Alright, we're three out of eight. Alright, ah. Uh. Let's see, we're, we're here. Maybe, um, there's like, there's more snow stuff here. How do I, I don't actually know how to get to still snow, which is actually where I want to go when we're actually trying to progress through stuff. Because there's no, there's not actually a path here. It just goes to there. So I guess I do actually have to go from east. I have to go, yeah. I have to go east from here. So let's try that. Maybe the uh, the cleric is there. The cleric shrine. In any case, I do need to get to still snow anyway. Yeah, there's some snow over here. Because that's where uh, Primrose's chapter 2 starts. And I do want to do that next. After I've uh, gotten more jobs and grinded a bit more. Ow. Ow. I actually put the dragon scarf onto Primrose because, uh, her, her attacks cost so much SP that I was like, yeah, I, I can throw this on her, even though I just, I need more SP increasing, like, accessories. Alright, wait, where's this go? Yeah, this goes to Western Still Snow Wild. Yeah, that's all right. Perfect. Oh, hey, owls. Nope. These things have to be weak to bows, right? Ow. Yeah, there we go. Oh, that was a waste. Whoops. Oh, well. Alright, 
Oh, these things aren't actually weak to fire. Oh no, they can heal. That's cheating. Only I can to do that. Oh, I think that brought back their guards too. Wow! How did you miss that? What are you guys doing? My goodness, Primrose. You have to pull through. Okay, yes, I see a shrine. Uh, North Reach, I have no idea where the hell that is. Still snow? Yeah, alright, well, there's a shrine in this corner over here. And we might as well hit the still snow while we're in the area so we get the fast travel point. Alright, please. Flame Bearer? Wait, that, that is, uh,. That is the cleric's thing, right? Because they, they bring the eternal flame to people. Is that what it's called? The eternal flame? They bring a flame around. I am Aelfric, flame bringer. Onto thee, who dost boldly venture to this place. I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Yep, we got the cleric. Neato. Alright. And again, since we're kind of in the area, I might as well head to Still Snow, because I do need to go there for Primrose's chapter two. And uh we can uh we can fast travel to it later when we're ready to go there. Healing grape. Oh, this combination again. Oh, it's weak to win. Alright, well, that's annoying. I don't even need to donate all of these. That's fine. I'll just steal some money, I guess. Or I won't. That's fine, too. Oh, man. I love... I love the fact that I could put uh, Scholar onto Primrose. That's so good. <laughs> Alright, uh, still snow. Right. Oh, also there's a cave here, I guess. Tomb of the Emperor 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 Imperator? Imperator. Emperor Emperor uh, Imperator. Imperator? I I feel like I should know what that word means, but I don't. Imperator. Man, how far away is the city? It has to be close, right? You have to be get look, there's there's houses. Yeah, here we go. That's right, I had business here. Uh, sometimes two chapters may commence in the same town. You can start a story whenever you want. If you want to stop or resume a certain story, just go to the tavern. Oh. So I can continue Primrose's story or enter town without continuing the story. You can pick up the story at a later time by visiting the local tavern. Yeah, alright. We'll do that because I do want to finish um, grabbing... Uh, 
the jobs. But we're in a we're in a new town, so new stuff to get. Oh my god. New stuff to get indeed. Better equipment. Chain breaker. Lots of speed. But I actually I need I guess, you know, I could wear this and then just rely on my staff to give me elemental. I, I honestly don't know how that works. But I'm assuming that's how it works when you, whenever you use magic, because it's pretty self-explanatory when you're using, um... When you're using weapons, you're using the, the stats that that weapon has. But when you're using magic, you're not using a weapon in particular, so... Yeah, I guess I have to look into that. Also, I can uh, buy slash steal stuff from people. Oh, level 20. I guess that makes sense. Oh, that's used for, uh, something. Anyways, uh... Alright, so what, we've gotten the Huntress, Cleric, uh, Scholar. We need... We need the Merchant? Which should be down here somewhere. I might have actually already seen it. I just never went for it. Or it might be down here as well. Um, soldier. Or is it... I think it's warrior. Dancer. And apothecary, so... Alright, let's go to Ripple Tide. We'll just go in order, I guess. Alright, so we're in the North Stone Guard Pass, and it looks like I found what I'm assuming is the Warrior Shrine. Like, just kind of right here, which is kind of nice. Shrine of the Thunderblade. I'm still- I was actually trying to find how to get to the Merchant. I- I just could not find it. Hail, Traveler. Th these guys, people all say the same thing. I am Brand, the Thunderblade. On to thee, who dost boldly venture to this place. I impart the knowledge of the heavens. And I got the warrior. All right, we're doing good. Uh, I'm just gonna keep walking around, I guess. Like, this goes to Stone Guard, which I do need to get to. There is a path up, though. There's a path up, so I need to find like a uh, like a sign, like right there. I don't know why I didn't look at this. Let's see. Cobblestone Stone Guard, Wellspring Everwood. Wow. Um, well, I don't know where this is going. Alright, so we ended up here in Moonstruck Coast. I actually totally skipped over going to Stone Guard. Because I wanted to find out where the shrine is. It looks like it's here. The merchant one, I'm assuming. This is also very far away from Ripple Tide. It's like right here. So, yeah. I don't know. It's very far away. But we made it here. This is also a level 23 area, and I just realized that Primrose made it to 21 while I was doing this whole thing. So I guess mission accomplished. We've actually been getting quite a bit of good EXP doing this. Lovely. Lovely.
Ow. Ah. Uh, no, that's fine. What the hell are you weak against? Fire? Wow. Alright, of course. The last thing I try. Why did I pick the whatever? Then I was thinking that. Alright, we finally made it. Shrine of the Traitor. Holy crap. That was quite the adventure to get here. It's very out of the way. I am Bifolgan, the traitor. Unto thee who dost boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. All right, all that's left is the dancer and uh, the apothecary. So let's go, let's go find them. So I have actually made a surprisingly large amount of level progress doing this. So I'm gonna actually switch out my party a bit. Alright. I'm actually not too concerned about Cyrus, because Cyrus is just always good. Throw old Beric in there. Whoops, nope. We'll do old Beric, Hind, and Cyrus. Yeah. I, was, I, I know I just said I don't really think I need to bring Cyrus with me. But, uh, yeah, I just, I don't have enough gear for Terry and Alberic to be in the party at the same time. So, that's what we're gonna do. Just go ahead and unequip all this stuff. Optimize. Optimize. I need more stuff. Optimize again. Let's see. Probably give that to you. Definitely. I might actually here. I'm gonna I'm gonna take the dragon scarf off of you. I don't know. You can put that on. I don't know. I don't actually know what to put on you. Uh, who wants the mighty belt? You can have the mighty belt, I guess. You can have some extra SP. Get some extra speed. Extra SP, and then you can have the dragon scarf. Yeah, let's go sleep at the inn. Actually, we probably don't need to. No, we don't need to. That's fine. We'll be fine. Alright, so... I'm trying to think. This leads to... Alright, so... The Thief's Shrine's here, so I'm imagining it'd be down, closer to where, probably like, Saints Bridge area is. So let's try and go south. Yeah, let's go this way. We might actually end up running into the Dancer Shrine before we run into the, uh, Apothecary Shrine. But that's fine.
Alright, what's your problem? An elderly travel, uh, traveler on a journey to see his grandson. Alas, owing to his terrible sense of direction, he has lost his way time and time again. In the past, he relied upon his wife to guide them safely to their destination, but without her assistance, he may be doomed to wander the road endlessly. Well, be with you, traveler. May I help you could help me. You see, I'm on a journey to visit my grandchild, but seem to have lost my way. I was bound for Clearbook, but tis not where I thought it was. Uh, well, sure, yeah, you can come with me. Uh, well, actually, maybe, maybe not. Uh, I'll be, I'll be back to get you. You know, you, you want my help, and I could lead you there, but, uh, yeah. Those aren't odds that I'm willing to uh, take right now. All right, we're at the East Saints Bridge Traverse. Oh, yep, look, there we go. Found the shrine. Well, found the shrine. I can see the shrine icon on my map. Which means the last one we need to get is the dancer. It's funny how somehow I managed to save getting the dancer shrine for last, even though I started as the dancer. But let's see. Lucky guess. <laughs> Ow. Ow! I'm not actually sure if you can miss magic attacks in this game. I don't think I've ever done so. Wow, that thing has a lot of health. Rain of arrows. Critical bow damage to single foe. Oh yeah, I forgot I can capture stuff. Hey, you're mine now. That's fine. I have so many of these uh, forest ratkins. Oh, you can get out of here. Fire. It wasn't fire, but we still killed them. Alright, where's where are we going? That's Saint Bridge, that's Clear Book. Alright. Well hello there. Uh no thanks. I feel like we're getting further away from our destination. What the hell's going on over here? What? Did you kill this man? Hmm. This poor soul was washed up by the river, but no one knows who he is. There's a large mole on the back of his hand, but nothing else to attend him by. I warned he was set upon by robbers of river and tossed in after all his worldly goods were taken. It's a crying shame if you ask me. At the least, I'd like to give him a proper burial. Aww. Oh. Let's see, a man who enjoys fishing as well as simply watching the flowing waters of the river. Though he hardly ever catches anything, on the rare occasion he does, the size of the fish tends to be rather impressive. Naru. Huh. That's an interesting quest, I guess. Hello, man. 72, sure. Oh my, what a bother. What a terrible, terrible bother. Oh, come on, man. I just, I need some information. This scholar who has conducted various studies throughout the land has many dread has seen many dreadful things. What terrifies him most, however, are natural disasters man is powerless to prevent. And this fear has driven him to consider ways in which humanity might survive these calamities. Information gleaned early ice thawing? Okay. Is that the is that a quest? I don't think this is. 
Yeah, if it wasn't for this. Early Ice Thawing. Shrine of the Healer. Well, I guess Apothecaries can heal. I wouldn't immediately um, associate the term Apothecary with Healer, but you know. Hail Traveler, I am a Doter, the Charitable. Unto thee who doth boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Unlocked Apothecary. Yay! Alright, we just got one more. Thou hast returned, Traveler. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> Thou hast returned, Traveler, but alas, I have no more to teach thee. Well, thanks anyway. I didn't actually need to go back out here. Or maybe I did, actually. Hold on. You know what? I bet it's down. It's south. So yeah, let's go to Sunshade. Man, I really like the Sunshade theme. Or not the Sunshade, I guess this would be... I guess these are the Sunshade Sands, or Sunshade Sands. Well, I don't know why that's difficult to say. I bet it's south from here, for the Dancer Shrine. Oh! That's kind of scary. Alright, let me, let me check it out. Let's scope it out. The Shrine is here. Alright, well... I don't have any healers with me either. Wow, this is... Alright. Let's see. Don't don't be too far away. Why is this in a level 30 area? Everywhere else was like, you know, high teens, low 20s. All right, we're almost there. Okay, we made it. <laughs> Thank goodness for evasive maneuvers. Voice echoes in your head. Hail, traveler. I am a Celtiage. Tell Celtiage. Celtis. Lady of Grace. Unto thee who doth boldly venture to this place, I impart the knowledge of the heavens. Excellent. All right, we've got them all, I think. So, where's Still Snow? Let's go to Still Snow, since we do actually plan to be using that. Actually, I do need some more levels, but I can probably do it outside in the, uh, the zone out here, so. No, not there. All right, time to figure out who gets what. All of life. All right, so. Yeah, let's figure this out. Alright, so I messed around with uh, all, all of everyone's jobs, and I finally figured out where I kind of wanted everyone to sort of be at. So, uh, Primrose, obviously we gave Scholar, and uh, I've been really enjoying that. That's that's a really good, strong combination there. Although, I, I, f I find that I'm not actually using her dancer skills that, that much, because uh, I'm just busy hitting things with, dam with magic, but uh, I'm sure in like... Uh, boss fights and, and tougher fights, the dancer abilities will be much more helpful. Um, Terry and I gave uh, Hunter. Uh, Heinz, I gave the Warrior. And Oberic, I gave Apothecary. Uh, Apothecary really works good for Oberic, I found, because uh, he can heal himself during duels, which is pretty nice. And plus, he gets to use Axis as well. Um, Alfin, I actually gave Claire, because that was all that was kind of left over after I kind of decided which jobs I wanted to give to people. But uh, also, he is kind of a healer, so Cleric might actually be kind of good, because then he gets uh, AoE healing as well. Although, I'm not sure what actually affects your your healing potential, if it's elemental attack or maybe even defense, I don't know. But um, 
I don't know, I guess we'll have to see how that works out. Uh, I gave Ophelia Dancer, I gave Tressa Thief, and I gave Cyrus Merchant, which... The merch. Everyone looks ridiculous as the merchant. It just... I don't know. It, I guess it's just the... the the, the the yellow and and having the backpack on but uh, Cyrus with merchant was actually pretty pretty nice because he gets wind magic and he also gets rest which is uh, just you know free free SP as well so yeah I'm pretty happy with with these things and uh, we'll kind of see because again we can kind of switch everything around as well I also found that um, while, while just kind of switching things around that you can keep uh, you get to um, you get to keep, uh, what, what are these? Uh, support skills. So, I have dancer support skills and scholar support skills on Primrose in particular. So, that's going to be in interesting because then there, there's definitely things you're going to want to want for, for characters. Like, I'm sure second win is going to be a must-have for Ophelia and probably Cyrus as well because they, uh, they use so much SP on magic. So... Yeah, it's gonna be interesting. I need to figure out what everyone's uh, all of everyone's uh, support skills are. I need to level up more, which is probably what I'm gonna end up doing now before I uh, continue on with Primrose. I mean, I could continue with Primrose, but uh, Terrian and and Hind in particular are kind of low on levels, so I want to get them a few more levels before we kind of continue on. So I'm actually gonna somehow be over leveled, which is something I wasn't expecting uh, for Primrose when we start her her next chapter, but that'll be fine. So, let's go get some more levels, I guess. Alright, I spent a little bit of extra time grinding a bit, but then I just kind of figured, you know what, everyone's level 15 at, at least now, so that's good enough for now, and we'll probably get more along the way, so. This is the party I ended up uh, sticking with, or what I'm pro probably going to use going into Primrose's Chapter 2. So, uh, Primrose, Ophelia... Tarion and uh, Tressa. So yeah, those are the four we're probably gonna bring with us, uh, or yeah, into this. But uh, I'm going to save, and then uh, we'll probably get to that next time. I have a lot of editing to do, a lot of stuff to cut out. As <laughs> there's a lot of exploring. Like I actually played quite a bit, but a lot of that was just literally just walking around trying to find all the shrines. So yeah, I'm actually pretty excited now. There's a there's a lot more. Um, a lot more possibilities now that we have uh, secondary jobs. Even just that that last like kind of 15 minutes that I kind of grinded, uh, it was way easier to get through battles because everyone had so many more weapons and abilities available to them that exposing weaknesses was uh, a lot easier. So, yeah, battles are hopefully going to go a lot more smoothly and be a lot more interesting now. So, looking forward to it. But uh, next time, next time. So, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you then. Sayonara, bye bye.